One, two, three. Welcome to Hobby Family TV. It's an exciting day at Hobby Family TV because we are going to be doing the Save the Egg Brick Challenge. That's right, each person has an egg. Each person must build some type of protective layer around the egg so it can survive a two-story fall. Whoa. Think you guys can do it? I think Hopefully. we can do it. Okay, little eggs. Ahead. Everyone pick an egg. I'm in this challenge too, so I'm gonna pick this one because it's calling to me, can you hear it? Yeah. I choose this one. I choose you. I choose 33. Okay, we all have our eggs. Yeah. Let's go build some protective armor. First thing we're gonna do is wash our eggs. That way, you know, I mean, I don't know what's been going on with this egg. So we're gonna wash them to make sure they're nice and clean, and then we're gonna get the building. Look at this little egg and giving it a bath. Aw, what a cute baby egg bath. There we go. These are not hard boiled eggs. These are eggs straight from the store. Like every brick challenge, we have destroyed Hobby Frog's room because that's where all the Legos are because he is our Lego master. Yeah. So we're spreading out the pieces that we need to find the parts that we need and then we're gonna have to clean it up. Hey, gotta make a mess to have fun, right? All right, I have my own plan. We're gonna see what they do and then I'm going to let them see what my plan is. I'm sure they're not gonna be happy with it. <laughs> Hobby Frog, what are you doing right now? I have a little plan going here. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna use this little castle wall and put the egg in there huh? as like huh. a protective shell. That's a good idea. Hobby Bear, what's your attack plan? What are you gonna do to make this egg be saved from a fall? Well, my first plan was using bone structure like this and putting this on top, but it can't fit. So I gotta make another plan. Plan B time already, huh? Hobby Pig, what is your attack plan? Okay, we're not sending it to the moon. Uh, we're not? We're dropping it from the second story window. Oh, it's like the opposite. Yeah. Oh, I don't want to do that. My egg will surely win with this. Is that, is that what you're gonna do? Yeah. You sure? Ow. My egg is in this. <gasps> he made his egg in there. Really? Wow. Oh, that was some promise. Let me see. There. Oh, wow. Would that save an egg from a drop? Uh, probably not, but I mean, we could try. Okay, so guys, I found something. This. Plus, if it splats, it matches the yellow. So nobody would know that I lost. That's not a good way to win. Yeah, are you sure that's what, really? It's a really, I can hear it wiggling around in there. It has to be tight, compact. So, probably not a good idea, then. That's your theory. We don't know yet. <laughs> We're gonna find out. Okay, so this raptor's name is Cool Dude, and he's gonna protect the egg as it drops. So as it's dropping, he's gonna jump down and then catch it with his headless head. And then the egg will hatch, and then the chicken will take over this body, and we'll have the first chicken dinosaur. So I'll be a Scientist genius to make the first living dinosaur and I'll win the egg drop challenge. Yeah, I'm not I just, I'm not seeing it. Not seeing it. Oh, see he almost dropped it already. Buzz light here. When he's a baby. Or before he was a baby. He's a baby? Yeah, he came from an egg. I guess he's so, not from Earth, right? My plan is fall. It lands perfectly like this. So it has more to do with your technique of dropping it. Yeah, I'll allow that. I allow technique of dropping. Okay. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Yeah. yeah what do you got? Well, you'd have to break the egg. You're already. You can't break the egg to save the egg. Rule number one: cannot break the egg. To, oh no! Don't please. I am going to use things that are technically from these brick companies that no one else has tried yet. The tire. Uh, I think this rubber squishy tire, if you put an egg in the middle, would save an egg. You can't use bubble wrap. It's against the rules. It's not a brick. 
But yeah, I think this could work. Oh, what do you got there, Hobby Pig? Okay! Put the egg in there. And then, I put another box over it. No, those are boxes, they're not bricks. You have to use brick parts. Like, th look at this. Look at the egg fit right oh. into this brick wheel. I think I have a good shot of winning. Oh, yeah, I really yeah. do. That's that's mine. You, you took I my just wheel. Found, yeah, I just found this out. You can't use my thing. That's my it's thing. My original idea. That is not your original idea. Hey guys. Oh, he's rolling it around. The Avengers have a mission. Where if they successfully. Wow. <laughs> do you want to try using that thing to see if it protects an egg? No. It's gonna fall for two stories. It'll go into millions of pieces. I really think this will work. The only thing that may happen is while it's falling, if it goes like this, and it's gonna hit straight to the ground, it'll probably break the egg. So, I'm gonna try to drop it to ensure that it lands on the rubbery goodness right here and just goes bonk. Hey, what? some Gorilla Glue. What? Okay, there we go. Wow, what is going on here? So, so this helmet is supposed to stay on at all times. As he's falling, oh, it's just, it just okay. fell off. What are so you pretend do? like my, I'm not holding it. Oh. So pretend like it's falling, and it lands on the head. Then, since to, due to the curve, it curves up and then drives to victory. And like drives to the store and buys some more eggs. Yeah. More okay. brothers. I don't know if that's gonna work. Why? Look, look it's, it's. Yeah, it just fell apart and it didn't even fall. No, it didn't. Let's see what Hobby Frog's working on. Ooh! Oh, you oh. heard me using wheels, huh? Yeah. So use that like as a shock absorber. Yep. It's pretty good. Add a little weight to it. Weight? It's gonna be falling, you wanna add weight? You're crazy. Just make sure you don't crack it while you're closing it. Yeah. Oh man. Yeah. Alright, Hobby Pig. What new design have you come up with? Okay, well it's not dumb. Okay. I'm okay. glad I'm glad you told me that. Here it is. I call it. The Eggmobile. The Eggmobile. I see the egg inside there. Yeah. Okay, so you think okay. he's gonna like fly away and not crash? Yes. So he's like, bam, he's gonna fall. Hopefully the tires will absorb the blow. That one that just fell off? Yeah, well, maybe. Well, the tires will soften the blow, and the egg, if it ends up going upside down, it, this absorbs it. But if it falls sideways, this will absorb it and falls sideways. I'm hoping for it to maybe fall like right here. I hope your egg cracks into a million pieces! And here is Hobby Bears. Whoa, nice big wheel on the bottom. And my daddy did help me a tiny bit. Well, yeah, I had to help him out a bit, but that is his concept. Nice egg cradle. We've got this nice giant wheel on the bottom that'll hopefully save the day. Hey, I'll be dead. Yeah. Look what I got. Oh, everyone's using wheels now. Yeah, okay. Yeah, sure. Okay, so let's see. We've got Hobby Pig's Eggmobile. We've got Hobby Bear's Clawlander. We've got Hobby Frog's Egg Grenade. Grenade. I'm calling mine Plain Old Wheel. It's a good name, right? Plain. It's a plain old. Let's go. Here we are outside and look. How high that window is, it's gonna fall all the way down here. And we're gonna see which one survives. If you ever have a windstorm and a lot of trees, this is what happens. Yes, we had a giant tree almost hit our house. Look at that, it almost got it. Yeah. So if you have any low hanging branches, just cut them before this happens, because that was scary. Yeah, we were able to hear it through our window. It sounded like fireworks. And it's always fun to film when someone's mowing their lawn. They do it all day, every day. Like, come on, people. Yeah. Hey, yeah. Frog, are you ready? No, but I'm gonna do it anyway. All right, egg's name. Hobby Frog Jr. Wow, but what if Hobby Frog Jr. splats? Then I will make a green stone for him. Okay, ready, go. <gasps> Tell you right now, I think it didn't work. 
Oh no! Hobby Frog Jr. Hobby Frog. Oh. Hobby Frog, what do you have to say about that? I'm sorry. He's sorry to that poor little wig right there. What's your name? Bear Claw. Bear Claw, I like that. Okay. Okay. Hobby Frog, go. Yeah, I don't know where it went. Oh, there it is. You can see its remains right there. This is the Eggmobile, okay? I'm ready to drop it. One, two. Check out our merch! That's right, you can get our shirts, hats, backpacks, and more if you go to www.hobbyfamilytv.com. One, two, three. <gasps> wow, that failed miserably. Fine. That was horrible. Look at the mayhem. Oh yeah, what is this? What's its name? Plain old wheel. That is the plain old wheel. Plain old wheel. Okay, we're gonna throw the plain old wheel. Do me proud when you drop it just right, okay? Hey, no, no. Yeah, there you go. One, two, three. Close. It was split in half. That was close. <laughs> All right, let's come down here and see who the winner is. So this is Hobby Pigs. That's just devastating. Oh, there's mine. It's, it's not too bad. Oh, there's Hobby Frogs. There's actually a lot of shell that did not get destroyed completely. And bears is just everywhere. I mean, look at that. Oh. Ugh. Oh, wow. It's hanging on by a string. It is hanging on by a string. I almost had that, though. Look at that. You did. I almost beat him, but look at that. That thing only has, like, one puncture at the top. Granted, it completely got smashed on the bottom, but that, that was pretty good. So what do you guys think? Wow. Okay. Mm. Mine looks like it did the worst. Yeah. Mine looks like it's the most intact. Here is the awards that we're giving out. We are giving an award to Hobby Pig for the most devastation. That thing exploded like cray cray. Take it. We're gonna give the nicest concept to Hobby Bear. The one that suffered the least damage by far is Hobby Frogs. Yay. Good job, buddy. You almost got an entire half of the shell without too much damage. And the worst effort goes to me, Hobby Dad, because I only used a tire. So, that's that. Welcome to Hobby Family TV. TV. We're going to do Save the Egg Challenge. We're going to build a boat out of bricks and I'm gonna do one exception. We're gonna be able to use water bottles. So to help it be buoyant, word of the day, buoyant. Buoyant. We're going to see if they can build a boat, if it can go down a water slide and survive the crash into the water. Whoever has the best design that saves the egg wins the challenge. The rules are you have to use Legos, water bottles, use one minifig, and that's about it. Let's do this! This is Hobby Frog's room with his massive Lego collection. We are going to build our designs. Let's take a look at what everyone's building. So right here, my design is, it's kind of like a cage. The egg is gonna go inside the cage. And I'm gonna put two Lego rubber bands. These are Lego rubber bands. I'm gonna put them around the cage so that it keeps the egg inside. You can't use rubber bands. It's, they're Lego rubber bands. Oh, they're Lego rubber bands. They're Lego rubber, okay, fine. They're Lego. The name of my build is Egg Cage because it is a cage for an egg. So this name of this is called Robot Nose because you can tell why. How do you think it's going to land in the water? It's going to go nose dive in this. So if it does hit the water really hard, this will kind of protect the front and the whole this wall will kind of protect the egg so the egg will be safe. I've been at it for about uh, 30 minutes. I think I came up with something that's really going to do the trick. 
So this is the Batmobile. I made it all by myself. Uh, the egg's gonna go here. Are you kidding me? You didn't feel that. Yeah, I did. Check, Check out our merch. Go to hobbyfamilytv.com and there we have shirts, hats, backpacks, and more. Again, that's hobbyfamilytv.com. We are on Cameo. Go to cameo.com and search Hobby Family and we will do a personalized video just for you, your friend, your your pet parakeet, whoever you want. But okay, okay first five minutes. You're right. I didn't build it. You got it a Batmobile. This, this is Hobby Frogs, Batwing, and I. Okay, I'll make my own. Fine. Here we have the Bat Boat. This is able to contain one minifigure. It has a little control panel here. It also has wings that are able to move freely, so that it's able to like kind of skid on the water like you would with like when you throw a rock, a rock on the pond or something like that. As you can see here, this is where the egg is supposed to be held, so that it's it's kind of snug. Uh, the windshield is able to hold it in, so that it's not able to like fly out. I do expect it to float because with Lego, it's kind of hard to make things to float. There used to be these holes, but I was able to get one by one studs and just kind of plug in those holes. So I think it's going to be able to flow. Here's my creation. Now the hobby kids have pointed out that I'm cheating because I'm using tires again in basically a pre-made boat. And they are correct. It's pretty much cheating, but who knows? I might lose really Dude. bad. Come on. Dude, just so you know which egg is which, we're painting them our colors. So mine's gonna be orange, Hobby Pigs is going to be green, Hobby Bears will be blue, and Hobby Frogs will be red. So here we are painting our eggs, getting them ready to go down the water slide. Right here I'm painting my egg green. I wonder if I should put a happy face on it. There we go, my egg is finished. Here it is. It is a bright, not bright, is it a, it is a dark, Green egg. P, there we go, P for pig. And soon, very soon, on the other side, I will put eyeballs and a smile. Put the happy face. So what I was thinking is that maybe because my vehicle, as you can see, is more of a like a Batman kind of thing. So I was kind of thinking that maybe I could do like a, a bat symbol or like a just like a bat logo on it. Just got my B done. So I'm gonna make the bat symbol now. Na 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 Batman. Time to load the egg inside of the vehicle. Good now. There we go. It's time to put the happy face pig egg inside the egg cage. Eh. I feel so terrible doing this. It fits! Oh my goodness, it fits. I didn't know if it's gonna fit. There we go. Perfect. It fits! I had no idea if it was gonna fit or not. And I'm using water bottles. I get a gold medal for this, right? I'm about to put this thing down the slide, and what I'm thinking is gonna happen is that it's gonna float, but the egg might be cracked a little bit. But that's my prediction so far. exactly what I predicted would happen, but it appears to be that the whole front of the vehicle has been ripped off. However, I am still happy with the, with the results because the egg is safe. Mission accomplished for me. So with mine, I I want to use this part so it can go air down, can go deep, floats up with these. Mine, the egg cage. 
will hopefully do well. This guy's piloting. Yeah, I don't know if he's gonna pilot well. Hope he, hopefully he will. Be safe. This is mine. And look, it didn't do bad. I think it might be safe. Let's open it and see. Wow, the happy face is still there. My egg has been saved. I did it. Well, before I rip this apart, I didn't lose a single piece. I promise I didn't. So this is Hobby Dad's boat, the egg arc. He wanted me to do it for him. So I'm gonna sabotage all of his plans and throw it down the slide really hard. Let's go. Ooh. See how my egg did. Oh, did pretty good. None of our eggs cracked, which means to tie. So we're gonna do a lightning round. We're gonna drop our eggs from all the way up there and, which, and see which one survives. Mine, the egg cage, will be first. Here we go. Three, two, one. My egg was built for water, not, not dropping off a tall, a tall structure. I thought I was gonna win because of the water bottle from the second page just flipped over, smashed everything. I thought I could win. I I think I could win. You know, I'm not exactly on board with this idea because this thing was made for protection and looks. Not for falling up cliffs. Uh, but rules are rules, I guess. Yeah, that way it didn't survive. At first, I wasn't very fond of the idea because it was mainly made from water protection. So I didn't really like it at first, but especially when I fell it, that's when I was the least happy. So when I was gonna put it down the water slide, it's like this, but for a drop, I'm gonna tilt it like that. So it lands on the tires. Good thing I used tires again. Here we go. I thought it would do better because I had the tires. I always go with tires. Uh, but the water bottles made it flip a little too much, and so it basically just crunched it right in half. It takes your comments to make any one of us win, so make sure to comment and let us know which design you like the best. Now let's go see which egg has the most damage. Let's go. I think this was Hobby Pig's egg. My happy face. Oh, his happy face isn't so happy. Uh, Over here is Hobby Frogs. My it's, masterpiece. You can see her just kind of laid out no. flat almost. Oh, there's Bears. Bears has oh, oh. almost like a half an egg. So half of it is still intact. That's where the hobby frogs and mine. And then there's mine. Oh, uh, it's still pretty, pretty beaten up. You've seen the damage. You leave in your comments who you thought won this challenge. H-O-B-B-Y, Hobby Family TV! Here we are, still under lockdown, so we're gonna do a Save the Egg Challenge. Cool. Each person gets one egg, each person makes one car. The egg will go down a ramp and hit a wall. Whosoever egg gets the least damage wins. Are you guys ready? Yeah! You must have four wheels, and you must include one minifig. Go! We are here in Hobby Frog's room where all of our Legos are kept. See, look at that nice organizer. Does our vehicle have to have a name? Your vehicle does have to have a name. Okay. You must name it, and it must save an egg from breaking into a wall. I wouldn't say at high speeds, but let's just call it ramp speeds. So I've finished my vehicle. It's this tank. Just kidding, that'd be funny though, right? I have a tank. It's protected because, I mean, nothing's going to stop a tank. Remember to check out our merch! www.hobbyfamilytv.com And if you would like a message from us to you on video, check us out at cameo.com. Just search Hobby Family. Now, you can't use treads. You have to have four wheels. That's part of the rules. Four wheels. And also, part of the challenge, the eggs are going to look like the Among Us crew. That's right. Each one of us is going to make our own Among Us crewmate except one of them is going to be the imposter. Look at that. <laughs> oh gosh. I, 
I, I use the style where I have really big wheels and really small wheels at the front. I think it's a pretty good system. It might work. Now we're making our Among Us eggs. We took a normal egg and we painted it to look like an Among Us character. How's yours going? It's going okay. good. Good, how about you? Mine's going pretty well. Ooh. It's still in the drying stage, but actually I should probably flip it over. All right, so the progress with my vehicle is that now I'm actually adding a little bit of detail on the back, but I'm trying to focus on the main structure. Hobby Pig, what's your progress? There's something inside here. Uh, there's a guy controlling it, and he's going to have the egg here. Well, Hobby Bear, what's your progress? Well, there, I've, been try, I've been trying my best to make this, and there's and it's tough to make white pieces to find some, and I finally found it. All right, so that is the status update. I will keep you posted on more updates that may come in your way. Show us your vehicle. Hey. What is the name of your vehicle? Tr trans transporting vehicle that's a good name so the transporting vehicle has too many things actually right yes this one's the front this is the back so if anything behind it is chasing it, it can destroy the things chasing it and that was not part of the challenge but okay yes. Ooh, that is super cool it goes right there the transport vehicle we're here with hobby frog he's got his creation all done what's yeah. it called the flaming egg the flaming egg Ooh. it's because it goes so fast that the egg is starting to burn and turn into scrambled eggs. Oh, I really like the minifig and how he has controllers and the windshield. That's really cool. Yeah, the windshield is mainly just to keep the egg firm on the top. Gotcha. So maybe we should call it Undestructo. We are here with Hobby Bear. What's the name of your vehicle? It's called The Box. The Box, what's that? Oh, wow, you used Lego minifig legs to make like some type of a ramming device? Yes, you just put the egg inside that box so you can see the egg. Gotcha. And the egg will go there, hopefully. Hopefully it'll fit. This is supposed to take the impact so it'll uh -huh. save the egg. That's an interesting design. I'm gonna call it Hulkatron. This is Hulkatron. Okay. Hulkatron! Let's see if Hulkatron has what it takes to win the challenge. I think it stinks. What is it with you and tires? What is it? Yeah. You keep using tires in every single build of yours. So the egg's gonna sit right in front of the Hulk. The tire is gonna add as a cushion so when it hits the wall, hopefully it won't smash. I thought like you were gonna put the egg inside the tire. Even though Hulk smash. Here are all of our amazing eggs. I kept my uh, fresh stamp on there so you know it's a fresh egg. Ooh. Yes. Nice. There's mine. Ooh, Ooh. Mine looks weird a bit. Leave in your comments below who's Among Us egg you like the best. And here we are at the Hobby Family Ramp. Yeah. We're gonna use that ramp so that our cars will go down. Bears first! You ready, Bears? Uh, yes. Let's do this. Pretty good. It's Hobby Pig's turn. Are you ready, Hobby Pig? Yeah. The moment of truth. There's a crack that runs all the way to the top. Oh, he is oozing. He's he is oozing. Where? Here it is. Oh, yeah. There is some ooze, yep. Yeah, there's ooze. Looks like his, his uh, booty part is, uh, not, didn't do so well. Here we go. Can the Hulk protect the egg? We're gonna find out. Three, two, one, go! <gasps> oh, yeah! What? Oh, 
That was amazing! Not even a scratch. You can't even tell it went through a crash. Unfortunately, Bears is over there just oozing out. He, just yeah, uh, his, left. he doesn't move. Oh, 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 wow. There's the main part of the yeah, brain. He didn't make it. He didn't make it. Yeah, he, yeah. Oh, that's, ah. that, that's worse. I do think that these two guys made it. Maybe they don't. Maybe not in the best shape, but I think yeah. they made it. Yeah. But this guy, look at that. Can I destroy mine? Um, sure, yeah, go ahead. Oh. There it is. I can do better than oh, that. Wow. Hey, wait, does that make you the imposter? <gasps> oh, bang. Oh. oh. Oh, that's not right. No. And the imposter. He's, the, he's an alien, that's fine. The bear doesn't have much to. Oh. Oh. Hobby Family TV! Welcome to Hobby Family TV. We're doing another Save the Egg Challenge. This yeah. time we're going to be dragging our egg creations Ooh. behind a bike. Who can handle the road rage? Oh no! All right, the best to survive wins, and uh, we might even crash everything off of a ramp just in case things aren't crashing enough. So the rules are that you must make a wheeled vehicle to protect an egg, and you have to have one minifig, and you have to be able to tow it from the front. So, ready, set, go! Go! Make creations of lego -age. Check out our merch at HobbyFamilyTV.com where you can get shirts, hats, backpacks, and more. Again, that's HobbyFamilyTV.com. We are on Cameo. If you would like a personalized message from us to you, go to Cameo.com slash HobbyFamily. <laughs> All right, I am Hobby Frog, and this is my creation. This is like a weird ship. I'm not really sure what this thing is. It's, it's along the lines of a spaceship with wheels. So, as uh, R2-D2 here, as you can see, and Darth Vader with a, um, a Captain America shield. The name I have for this thing is Wheeled Bird. This is my creation. I call it Super Deluxe or Deluxe Awesome Masterpiece. And SpongeBob's piloting it right now. So the egg is supposed to open up, go inside here. Really creative. Um, uh, it's a really creative design. I've never done anything like this ever before, where it's a cage over the egg. Hey, you did that on the last one! No, I didn't! Yes, you did! No! Look at the last video! This gorgeous thing is a truck, because and this thing's called Metal Blue Beer Thingy. So basically, it's going to go in here, and these are going to protect it. And I'm going to use this. I built it myself. It's a tank from World War II. It's, what? it's a World War tank. No. Hey. Okay, I didn't make this. This is Dude. not. I'm gonna put the egg in here. No. All right. No. no. This is my creation. All right. And uh, I put this here so that the wheels can turn, so that way it doesn't flip over. I am cheating. I mean, utilizing these wheels to give the egg some bumper so that if it comes here, it doesn't crack. And I have this here to kind of keep it in place. Junkrat. Junkrat is right here. He is my minifig, and this is where we're going to tow it. I have this little connector right here. So hopefully my design will work. Uh, I'm gonna call this one um, Omelet. Now is where we see if an egg will actually fit in our vehicles, because who knows, it may not fit, so let's see. I can't close this because it's not closed, but it kind of keeps it from moving around, so I think I might keep it that way. So it fits. Okay, let's see if an egg's gonna fit in mine. Gee, all right, so you wanna make some modifications or do you like it? Oh, he's already making modifications, he can't help himself. So now I'm gonna take the top of it off. Let's see if the egg fits. I'm pretty sure it will. There we go. It fits. Yes. Now I put the top over it. There we go. And my pilot is SpongeBob. 
most fierce warrior in the universe. It fits. Alright, do you want to do any modifications? Yes, I do. Okay, what are you going to do? It's going to put some walls right here on each side. It's a good idea. So wow. this, this roll out. It. I made this back part a lot longer so that it would actually be able to fit in it, the egg in it because it was a little too tight. So I'm glad I made these modifications and I'm ready for the big test. All right, so I had this post here and I realized that if the post is here, it's not gonna help guide the wheels. So I put the post here that way when the bike moves, it'll actually make the wheels move as needed. That would not happen if it was here. It would just not be very effective. So that is my modification. So my modification is I had some walls, nice walls, and I, for some reason I just thought it would be good to have it on the back side of it, so I put it in the front so it would not snap off like, it was really tough. Gonna add a little mod another modification, gonna do this, it can work. So we are going to be dragging our creations behind this bike. We've got a GoPro here so that we can see all the devastation, oh no. Oh no, the Triceratops. Hey, you know what? I need fish, fishing line to connect, thank you, to connect our creation, so that's perfect. We are going to show Hobby Pig airing up the tire because our back tire is flat, so enjoy. Hobby Pig fills up a back tire. He's gonna put the egg inside of his vehicle. We're gonna go three times around or until he crashes to see if it'll survive. Oh! Couldn't take the first turn. So we'll leave him here and we'll see how the other ones fare. So let's see, uh, it's Hobby Frog's turn next. Yeah. All right, let's see if you can make three times around the track. Okay, let's see. Butterfly! Ah, that's terrible. I, want, I want to eat it. Oh, it's already lost the flame. Did I make the turn? It made the turn. All right, let's okay. back up. We got to give Pig some room. Oh, we got to give Pig some room. Up. So far, so good. Yay! Oh! Go, Artem, go! Here comes the last turn. And yeah. he made it! <laughs> oh, oh. He yes. even survived that. I am so glad that this barely had any damage to it. Like only a flame piece was detached from it. Now I'm gonna check out the egg damage. Wow, no egg damage whatsoever. Where do you even connect this thing? Where is, is there a place to connect it? Yeah. That was one of the rules. Where am I supposed to connect it? Oh, I, no. You're supposed to connect it where the arm is. Oh, the arm is, okay. I was wondering. I have a really good feeling about this, guys. I think this one's gonna go the distance. I really do. Yeah, well. I think this is gonna be awesome. All right, can do it. Oh. Hey, it worked. My egg survived. Right? You didn't make the three laps. Yeah, but my but my egg lived. But you didn't make the three laps. Yeah, but bears okay. bears act. I but farther than bears. Right now you Not may have second place. Cool. <laughs> All right, here we go. It's my turn. There's my creation. Hopefully it'll survive. The only thing I'm really afraid of is that Hobby Pig is the one in control of the bike. <laughs> Don't trust that guy. Yes! Not with my Lego creations. Ready? Let's go. Careful, careful. Oh. <laughs> you did that on purpose! I just started! Man, I had high hopes too. Wait, no! 
Wow, he just really... Oh, gee. <laughs> he's fine, right? Oh, no, he's not. Since Hobby Frog won, his vehicle will be going up the ramp of destruction. Now we'll see how well his egg survives. Let's do it. I don't have a very good feeling about this one. Okay. Want me to go? Yep. So uh, how'd you feel about destroying your brother's model? It felt like the best thing I've felt in the world. Oh, the carnage! My goodness. Whoa! Yeah, that's not how that happens. No. And then I was right there uh, with no damage. So Hobby Pig and Hobby Dad had no damage, but we only got that far, but Hobby Bear did have damage, but he went that far. So who really got third place? Leave that in your comments below. Is it Hobby Pig, Hobby Dad, or is it Hobby Bear? It was me! But who won the day is yeah! Hobby Frog. Woo! Mine did get destroyed completely. Yeah, he went three laps, no damage. Yeah! That is amazing. Woo! Thanks for watching Hobby Family TV. Make sure to like and subscribe. And remember to click on one of these videos to keep the fun family yeah. stuff going. And uh, leave a comment to see what other videos you'd like us to do. But stay tuned for more Save the Egg videos. See you on the next video. Toodaloo! Toodaloo.